The most popular means of transport in big cities is the metro. It was first introduced in London, and then major cities around the world built their networks one after the other. But as cities expand or as the popular means of transportation spreads to other parts of the world, more and more cities begin to build their own networks. In today's video, we look at the 20 biggest subway projects of the future. Number 20. Santiago Metro. We start our journey in the capital of Chile. A city in South America is undergoing huge development, and now the development of transportation is also considered important. The city currently has seven metro lines, and there are plans to extend the existing lines and build Line 7, Line 8 and Line 9. The entire network is planned to open in 2033, when the network will consist of five lines. In addition, a Line 10 is planned, which would be a one-way loop railway in the city center, like the many projects that propose to connect the suburbs. $3 billion will be spent on the entire project. Number 19. Toulouse Aerospace Express. The next mega project is being built in one of France's main industrial cities. The project, sometimes abbreviated as TAY, will include three lines. More specifically, two have already been completed, which we are currently talking about will be the third C line. This will be completed by 2028, and the B Metro line and the T2 tram will be extended within the framework of the project. Line C will be 27 kilometers long with 21 stations, and will be operated by automatic trains, similar to the current Metro lines. The cost of the new Metro line alone is 227 million euros, so the entire network will cost 3.3 billion dollars to build when fully completed. Number 18. Delhi Metro Phase 4. India is huge, and although we are talking about a developing country, there are a lot of people living here. Delhi, the country's most populous city, currently has 10 metro lines and is still one of the busiest in the world. The current network includes the first three phases, which are already completed, despite some expansion plans. Phase 4 will include six lines with a total length of 103 kilometers. The entire fourth phase will be ready by 2029, and these will primarily serve the expanding and constantly growing city. In addition, they propose to build a fifth phase, but this is not yet certain. The price of the fourth phase will be $3.3 billion, most of it will open in 2025. Number 17. Bogota Metro. This is another mega project being built in South America, this time in Colombia on the northern coast. The capital of the country is developing the most among all areas, which requires the construction of the subway. Currently, only Medellin has a subway in the country, and a 24-kilometer 16-station subway will be built in Bogota. It is expected to be completed and put into operation by 2028. Construction began in 2020, after many plans and scandals, as well as a long wait. The line will run almost completely above the ground, the stations will all be elevated, speeding up and modernizing transportation. The entire project will cost $4.3 billion. Number 16. Dubai Metro Blue Line Dubai currently has two metro lines and plans to build more in the future. But for now, let's just deal with the construction of the Blue Metro Line, which was announced last year. The 14-station, 30-kilometer long subway starts from Academic City, then goes on and branches off, finally running into the terminus of the current two subway lines. Among other things, it will serve the New Creek District and the eastern part of the city, as well as the cities and mega-projects being built there. The price of the project is $4.9 billion, and it is expected to be completed by 2029. Number 15. Interborough Express. We already mentioned a New York subway project in a previous video, now let's talk about a mega project that is not being built in the city center. Many people work and live in the suburbs. But if they want to get to their workplace, they have to travel into Manhattan and cross from there to their workplace, there is no subway line that only runs in the suburbs. It's not a subway, it's going to be light rail. The Interborough Express, which will be a 22.5 km subway project by 2027, would offer a solution to this. It will run through 19 stations on a disused freight line, so costs will be relatively low, costing $5.5 billion. Number 14. Beijing Metro Phase 2 and 3. The capital of China, Beijing, and such a populous city and country also require the development of the subway network. Let's not forget that China is undergoing great development, but this also affects transportation in all respects. 
The length of the current network is 836 kilometers, as in India, the expansion is being implemented in phases. When phase 2 is completed, it will be 998.5 kilometers long. Dotted lines on this map show progress by 2028. Phase 3 will include 11 projects, this was announced in 2022. The table below shows what new lines and extensions they want. The government is serious about development, they want to spend $5.8 billion on it in the future. Number 13. MRT Circle Line Kuala Lumpur's metro network is exemplary and world-class, currently consisting of seven metro lines and operated by Prezarana through 144 stations. Known as the New Circle Line, the project will serve the Kuala Lumpur area, the Klong Valley, with 31 stations over 50 kilometers and two depots to store trains. It will be built in two phases, the first by 2028 and the second by 2030. It does not enter Kuala Lumpur's central business district, but connects the radial railway lines. Like the city's current lines, it will also be automatic, most of it will run above ground. The costs are currently estimated at $6.5 billion. Number 12. Dublin Metro. Dublin is a European capital that interestingly does not have a subway. The city is currently still served by trams. But now they want to build an 18.8 km long metro line with 26 stations, in a north-south direction, which will also include the city's airport. It was preceded by many scandals, because according to many there is no need to build the subway, most recently it was suggested that construction should start in 2025, and then it could be completed by 2035. The metro would touch the city's busiest junctions, and would go mostly underground. If ever completed, it would cost $10 billion. Number 11. Warsaw Metro Expansion Warsaw's metro network is constantly developing, with the newest metro being the M2, which has been delivered in stages since 2015, and there is only one section left to complete. Looking further, the M3 metro project has already been accepted and will be completed by 2032. By 2050, however, they want a much larger network, namely with the extension of the aforementioned M3 subway, the northern extension of the M2 subway, the construction of the east-west M4 subway, and the M5 also with a north-south line. The cost of the entire project is estimated at $10 billion based on current prices, but they are moving towards implementation. Number 10. Moscow Metro Expansion Even though Russia is at war and under sanctions from the West, it has grown its economy in the last two years, and that includes expanding the capital's metro network, which is one of the most beautiful in the world. First of all, with the development of suburban lines. An iconic shape of the Moscow Metro is the two-circle metro, and they want some kind of project like this, for roughly $11 billion. By 2029, the last project will be completed, it will include 42 stations, with an expanded network of 62.4 kilometers. Projects will be opened already this year, but they will be continuously expanded. After all, it is one of the largest metros in the world. Number 9. Jakarta Metro In 2019, the subway network known as the Jakarta MRT was opened in Indonesia, and it currently consists of one line. It was built for $1.2 billion and is called Phase 1. But they would continue to build and three more phases are planned, at which point the metro network will consist of two lines. The subway will cost $15.4 billion, but the prices will be financed by Japanese and Korean investors. The current line is currently being developed. It will be ready by 2029. The east-west line is only being planned, its financing has not yet begun. By the way, the metros are self-driving, and all stations are built to a world-class standard, thus also representing the development of the country. Number 8. Sydney Metro Australia's largest city has had a subway since 2019, but it is only available to a limited extent. The rest of the city is still served by suburban trains. First, the current line will be further extended under the bay to the southern part of the city. This will soon be completed in 2024, but in the future it will affect the city's new airport. However, they don't want to stop there, they want to create five more metro lines by 2056, two of which are already under construction. The city is very committed to the projects and they want to spend $21.6 billion on it. Number 7. Riyadh Metro. In addition to the 170-kilometer-long city, the 400-meter cube, and the world's tallest building, Saudi Arabia also wants to build a subway network. This has been planned for a long time, and it was only partially delivered last year. However, they want to finish it for good by 2024. 
But what exactly does it contain? In the Riyadh Metro project, they want to build six lines with a length of 176 kilometers from scratch with 85 metro stations. They will be the most beautiful subway stations in the world, both underground and above ground. The subway assemblies were manufactured by three different companies. The price of the milk project is $22.5 billion, becoming one of the most expensive transportation projects in the world. Number 6. Mumbai Metro. In 2014, the metro network of India's second largest city was handed over, although it only started to function normally a few years ago, until then it was possible to travel by suburban train. The project was designed after it currently consists of three lines, nine are under construction, and six are planned. The lines currently under construction are planned to be delivered by 2025, this table shows what is planned. It will include new metro lines as well as the expansion of the current three. After that, it will fully serve Mumbai and its surroundings like Navi Mumbai. The city is spending $30 billion on the development of metro transport. It will be fully completed soon. Number 5. Shanghai Metro Expansion We have already mentioned the Beijing subway, and now one of the world's largest subway networks would be expanded in the country's largest city, Shanghai, as has been the case in recent years. The current network looks like this, it consists of 19 lines. The future map can be described like this, but we are not far from that. Most of the projects are already being built, they want to create 22 projects, they will cover 266.4 kilometers. Among other things, the new lines will serve cities far from the city and connect them with downtown Shanghai. For all this, $43.3 billion will be committed. Number 4. Tel Aviv Metro and Light Rail Another country currently at war is Israel. But despite this, a transport development project is being organized in the country's coastal resort city of Tel Aviv. The $46 billion development will include three subway lines and three light rail lines, more precisely the LRT lines were handed over last year. The metro lines will be 150 kilometers long and will consist of 109 stations. Most of them will be completed by 2032, some will be handed over in stages, the government has accepted all the plans for the lines, but until then only the LRT lines will be running. Number 3. Singapore Metro Expansion Despite being just a small city-state, Singapore is one of the richest countries in Asia. Of course, this is also due to the boat traffic, because the city is located along a busy route. The city has perhaps the cleanest subway network in the world, and in 2021 the parliament passed a $60 billion transportation development project. The amount will fund upcoming projects such as the Thompson East Coast Line, the Jurong Region Line, and the extension of the Northeast Line and the Downtown Line. All projects will take place over the next 10 years, but also include renovation projects and the modernization of existing stations. Number 2. Grand Paris Express. The next mega project will be built again in France and will play a key role in the 2024 Olympics. The project, which has been under construction since 2015, will be handed over this year, but let's see what exactly it contains. First, Metro Lines 11 and 14 will be expanded, and the city will get four new lines, which are Lines 15, 16, 17, 18. These represent an extension of 200 kilometers, and the city will be enriched with 68 new stations. The total price is estimated at $45 billion, it will serve not only traffic, but also the challenging Olympics. Number 1. Suburban Rail Loop This is already the second mega project to be built in Australia, but this one will be implemented in Melbourne. Melbourne's public transport is primarily provided by trams and light rail metros. However, now the city wants to build a more serious subway line that will serve the suburbs. Fully automated trains will run on the 60-kilometer long line, at high speed, completely underground. However, this makes the project currently under construction more expensive and uncertain. Prices were originally estimated at $33 billion, but now that price is $133 billion. The project was announced before the Australian elections in 2018, but now the opposition has been forced to delete the mega project from the list, as it has no future due to the continuous increase in costs, so it will probably not continue in the next period. If this were to happen, it would be completed between 2035 and 2040. 
Of course, there are also many other projects, such as the Brisbane Metro or the Prague Metro Line D. If you would like to learn more about more Metro projects or what you see in the video, then watch the other parts of the series, and for more videos, support our channel with your subscription. Thanks for watching, see you in the next time. Thank <laughs> you.